Upload your doubts on the app to get video solutions. Galvanometer, there is a deflection of 10 divisions per milliampere, which means 10 divisions per milliampere current is flowing, right? The internal resistance of the galvanometer is 60 ohms. So let me just write this as internal resistance as RG. So RG is internal resistance of the galvanometer, which is 60 ohms, correct? If a shunt resistance, so let's call it as capital RS, shunt is small here, which is 2 point because this is converted into ammeter. So 2.5 ohms, okay, is connected to the galvanometer and there are 50 divisions in all, okay. So number of divisions are 50, okay. On the scale of galvanometer, what is the maximum current, okay, the, that can, okay, what maximum current can this galvanometer read, okay. You have to find the current, maximum current, this galvanometer that can read. Correct. So what we will do here is, first of all, we know uh, there are 50 divisions, okay, as per the question, the galvanometer has 50 divisions in all, right. So if there are 50 divisions, what is the current through the galvanometer? See, it says 10 division per milliamps, correct. So current, which is required for full scale division will be IG, that will be 50 divisions divided by 10, that will give you 50 divided by 10, that is and milliamps, that will be our current through the galvanometer for full scale division. Let me repeat again, for full scale division, the total divisions divided by 10 division per milliamps. So that milliamps goes in the numerator, right? So 50 by 10, which is 5 milliamps, that is the current in full scale division. Now let I be the current, let I be the current or let me call it as maximum current, maximum current, okay. Then we know a relation, the current through the galvanometer must be equal to the shunt resistance RS whole divided by the equivalent of both RG plus RS into current, maximum current I, correct. I hope this is clear. So I will be equals to IG into Rg plus Rs whole divided by Rs. Now, here uh, let's put the values. What is Ig? Ig is 5 milliamps. So, 5 into 10 to the power minus 3. Rg, Rg is how much? 60 plus Rs 2.5 whole divided by 2.5. Now, let's cancel this 2.5 with this. This is 2 and here it will be 2 into 10 to the power minus 3 into uh, 62.5. Correct? Now let me multiply this, it will give you 2 5s are 10, so 0 will go, 2 2s are 4, 2 6s are 12, 124 milliamps, that's our approximate current, which is maximum current, which can the galvanometer read, done. This is our complete answer to this question. Watch the complete playlist on the app Pions, download the app now.